goes in, and they're all in line. They're off. Majestic Hussar broke very well. JIC on the outside out with speed. To the inside of them, it's Road Agent and Palace Malice came out with speed too. Four of them close up for the front. They're being followed by City of Weston and Pepe to the inside. And a seven length gap back to the two trailers all keyed up and denied permission. It's Majestic Hussar on the outside and neck in front. And down toward the inside, Road Agent runs in second. These two with Palace Malice right behind them through a 22 and 3 opening quarter. There's a half mile to go. And then it's City of Weston. JIC to the outside and Pepe along the rail. And still about seven lengths back to denied permission and all keyed up. Around the far turn, Majestic Hussar has opened up a two length lead on Palace Malice after a half mile and 45 and three fifth seconds. And then it's City of Weston, Road Agent back to fourth along the rail. JIC is after that. Pepe all keyed up and denied permission. They're coming to the top of the stretch, and Majestic Hussar is still the leader, coming a bit wide into the lane, but still in the clear by three. Palace Malice on the outside is second. They've left the others behind. Majestic Hussar down to the 16th pole, clear from Palace Malice, and it's a long way back to the others. Coming down to the wire, Majestic Hussar. Wins by two and a half lengths. Palace Malice was second, City of Weston third, and then Road Agent. Changed. It will be run at a mile and a half on the turf, not a mile and seven sixteenths. The distance will be a mile and a half, and the rail position is at 72 feet. In the second race, scratch numbers three, Treasury Devil, and four, El Romano. No changes in race three. Race four is off the turf. Race four is off the turf. Scratch numbers one, three, five, six, eight, nine, and 15. The jockey for number 12 is Francisco Torres. And in the fifth race, scratch number seven, Honey Child.